My dear friend in Christ, on a bright Sunday morning, a young guy drove in his expensive Jaguar into a nearby village. There he spotted a shepherd tending over a large flock of sheep. He thought of impressing the shepherd with his knowledge of technology and so he asked the shepherd, Do you know, with my latest gadgets I can tell you the exact number of sheep you have without counting them, that too in just 60 seconds. The shepherd was deeply impressed and was eager to know how he could do it, that too in 60 seconds. Please show me how you do it, sir, he said. Now for the sake of a challenge and some fun, the young guy said, If I am right, will you give me a small sheep as a prize? And the shepherd gladly said, Most certainly. And my dear friend in Christ, within minutes, the young guy took out his laptop and a few gadgets from his vehicle, placed them on the bonnet, then placed a dish antenna. And in 60 seconds, he declared, There you are you have 641 sheep. Now the shepherd was shocked, clapping his hands and applauding the man. He said, exactly sir, I have 641 sheep and you deserve your prize. Please take a sheep. Feeling excited, the young guy picked up a fluffy white one and put it in his vehicle. But when he put it in his vehicle, the shepherd laughed saying, Sir, what you have taken is not my sheep. You have picked up my little dog. So I see you can count sheep, but you can't tell the difference between a dog and a sheep. My dear friend in Christ, that is the truth of life. How true it is with our life. We have so much of knowledge, so much of technology, but there are still some things we still don't know or understand. Think about a doctor. A doctor can treat you, but he cannot feel the intense pain you go through, both physical and emotional. It's only you who can experience that. Think about your spouse. Your spouse can live with you for a lifetime and still not understand some things about you. There are so many spheres of our life that nobody can fully understand or feel. But there is one, my dear friend in Christ, one who can understand, who can feel exactly how we feel and that is Jesus, our Good Shepherd. We have a beautiful image of Jesus as Good Shepherd in the Gospel of John chapter 10 where we know that the shepherd knows his sheep, he knows the sheep by name, he calls them out by name and they follow him and he goes ahead of them and the Gospel says that not one of the sheep can be snatched away from his hands because they are given to him by his Heavenly Father. Such is the intimacy, such is the love, such is the care the Lord Jesus, our Good Shepherd, has for each one of us. So my friend, when you feel that no one understands you, when no one feels with you, when someone doesn't care for you, just picture Jesus, the Good Shepherd, carrying you with great love on His shoulder. Reflect upon the Gospel of John chapter 10 and feel the love of Jesus, the Good Shepherd. May you have a good and godly day.